Liz is up first in Jacksonville, Florida. Liz, you're on the Ken Coleman Show. Hi, Ken. How are you? Uh, Liz, I'm living the dream. What's going on? <laughs> I wish I were. Well, we're going to work <laughs> on that right now. <laughs> well, what's going on? What's going on is that I am currently you know, working in a position. Uh, I'm in sales. I've been in outside sales for okay. quite a few years. Uh, never been one of those star, you know, top producers. So... Here I am at this age, which is just over 60, wondering, should I even been, you know, am I good at this? Should I even be in sales? Should I have trained for something a little different? Should I, you know, I do have a degree, but it means nothing where I am. Right. It means nothing. Really, it doesn't. Yeah, I, I, trust me. Ago. I believe you. Well, so the question yeah, is I'm this, do. what do you want to do? So you're 60-ish. What do you want to do? I wish I knew that, and that's why I'm calling. Right. I, yeah, let's focus I on some, that. I need let's some, focus on yeah. that. Yeah, I don't, I'm not really concerned about whether or not right now that you think you're good at outside sales or not. I think the question is, what did you wonder about? And, I, and I, I'm going to challenge you because I don't okay. think that you don't have a thought. I said, what is it you want to do? And you go, I have no idea. I don't know if that's true. I think you have some ideas but you're not sure if they're good ideas or you're not sure how to get there, or maybe you're not you're sure right. if you have enough time to get there. So exactly. there I know the time. I know I've, I've, I've done this a few times. So now let me yeah. re-ask the question and I want you to turn your brain off. All I right. want you to just let your heart answer. Liz, what do you want to do? I think real estate, I think something to do with, Oh, there you went. Your brain just came you. back. Your brain came yeah. back. <laughs> so, so, yeah, that's okay. But Liz, listen, don't edit your answers. I want to know what your heart says when I say, Liz, if we knew you could not fail, you just get to explore and try something to see if you would really enjoy this kind of work because you're good at it, you enjoy it, and the results matter to you. What is it? I want to cook. I want to entertain. Oh, okay. You want to cook and you want to mm -hmm. entertain. All right. Mm -hmm. So where would you do that? Just for fun. Don't don't get all hung up again. Don't get your brain involved. Just where in the marketplace would would you, Liz, be able to cook and entertain and get paid for it? Well, okay. See, where I would do it, and really enjoy it would be at home with, with people and family and that sort of right. thing. But that's not going to get me paid. No, it's not. So, it's not. Yeah, in the marketplace. I mean, I, I've thought about you know culinary school and chef, you know being a chef. But uh, you know, I've thought about corporate cater. I I don't know. I I don't. I do know this. I don't want the. I I don't think I want the. Those type of hours. No. So, how much money do you need to make at this point in your life? What what's a what's the income that you need? Well, I need, you know, for my, to maintain the lifestyle that I have, which isn't, you know, extravagant at all, but, you know, I, I need about you know, at least $75,000, $80,000. Okay. Is that what you're making? Is that what you're making now in sales? 75 no, to 80? No. What are you making right now? <laughs> it's rough. Um, Liz, you listen, you got to trust me. Now you trusted me enough to call me. Now you've got to trust me while you're on the air with me. Cause I'm telling you, I'm I, making, I can right help now I'm, I'm making less than 30. Okay. You make less than 30. Are you double income, single income? Yeah. Single. Okay. So you're single. All right. And so you are, you, are you struggling or are you just living tight on less than 30 K? Oh, I'm living very tight. Yes. I'm struggling because I'm, I'm in debt. I mean, I'm, I'm okay. going to, you know, work that plan too i've been trying to work that plan okay got but. it got it okay that now i have the full picture okay so what we've got to do is is we we have to say okay what is the work that i would love to do that i can actually do and make money at it okay because you can throw dinner parties right now once you get some breathing room you know and you can do that kind of thing and maybe eventually you have your own maybe you start your own 
side hustle eventually to make some more money, even help you get out of debt. You start cooking stuff and selling it, okay? And right. local farmers are, that's the kind of thing you can do on the side, okay? But yeah, culinary culinary school is not the road for you because you don't want to work those no. crazy hours. So right. you first said real estate. And mm -hmm. I want to go back to that because I want to know the why behind real estate. Give me give me 10 seconds on why that was an idea that you've that you've played with. Well, you know, I don't know what I, I, I really enjoy, I enjoy my home. I enjoy seeing other people's homes. I, you yeah. know, I have the sales experience. Uh, I interact yeah. well with people. Um, I, I, I have, the, I think I have what well, I'll say this. I'm more of a big picture. The, the industry that I'm in, I, I'm very, I, the, the, nitty gritty details i i just know is not me got it so now, what are you selling right now what do you what's the actual service you don't have to give me the name of the company but are you selling a service or a product well both but more <laughs> liz i've never I'll, I'll just i have tell you, never it's lighting. yeah it's, lighting. it's maintenance it's 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 i'm in the facilities maintenance industry okay and it's All lighting right. Part of the problem, part of your problem, <laughs> let me tell you what I think part of the problem is, is that you're selling something, or at least you're you're not selling a whole lot of it, is, is the bottom right. line. And I'm not picking on you. I'm on your team. I'm on Team Liz. But you're not passionate about what you're selling. You don't like it. No. You don't like no. the product or the service. It's too detailed of a sales transaction, the interaction with the customer. So back to your initial question, I don't think that you suck at outside sales. I think that you're selling something that you're not excited about. And I've never met a really successful salesperson who couldn't at least manufacture some fake excitement, but you can't even do that. And that's not knocking you. That's just the facts. Right. No, I get it. I get it. Yeah. You're right. So it's, you and I are on the same page yeah. now. Now, listen, here's the deal. There's two ways to go about this. Number one, you either work your web of connections in Jacksonville, Florida, and you get yourself a different sales job where you're selling a product or a service that you actually like and could get excited about it. And the transaction, the interaction of the sales process is more wired to you, i.e., example, real estate. Now, that's one path is you leave this current job after you go find a better sales job that makes you more money. And if you can double your salary in the next 12 to 18 months, that means we're paying off debt a lot faster and we've got a really good future ahead of us. Now, that's one okay. path. The other path is you stay in this crappy thing right now and keep struggling and you spend all your extra time studying for the real estate exam and you pass it, you crush it, and you spend all your other time when you're not studying and you're not sleeping, you're not eating and working, you're talking to other real estate professionals out there who you've got some relationship with and they kind of give you the, 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 you know, kind of, they're, they're friendly. They're not looking at you as competition and, and they give you, you know, some insider tips. Um, right. But yeah, you, and you, get, you get qualified and then you start selling houses. And yeah. you go all in. So you, you, you know, do whatever it takes, move in with a girlfriend, sell some stuff, really sacrifice. Cause to win at real estate, you're going to have to go all in at some point, all in. Yeah. Oh yeah. Burn oh, yeah. the ships. No, I, I get it. And, yep. uh, I would really recommend that you scrape some money together and get connected with my friend, Brian Buffini. He's the best. He's the Dave Ramsey of the real estate world in that he trains real estate professionals. And if you use his system and you take his training, you're going to crush it. And so at the, in, at the age of 60 ish, you can make more money than you've ever made. Making 70 to 80 is not going to be a problem at, in real estate in Jacksonville. It's just not. And you're right. a people person. You actually know how to sell. You love homes. You love everything about it. And and so you spend the next decade, you know, 10 to 15 years, you can eventually go part-time as a real estate agent, you know, and only sell when you want to sell, you know. So there you go. I, I think that's what this is. This is all in. I'm tired of debt. And so the way out of debt is for me to sell houses because I can get out of debt and live the life I really want to live. And it's still something that's in your sweet spot. You're good at it. You enjoy it. And it creates a result that matters to you. Correct? Right. Correct. All right, Liz, stop thinking. You know, you you have got you have got to stop thinking about all the things that could go wrong and why this might not work, and you got to start believing yeah. that you can do it. Do you hear what I'm saying? I do. All right, now I listen. Yeah, I, I want you to hang on because I'm going to put you on hold, and Madison's going to get you a free membership to Ramsey Plus. 
Okay. Oh, now, Rams, God bless you. you listen, you need it. Ramsey Plus has got Financial Peace University in it. That's the nine week course. Take it, mm -hmm. do it. It's got our every dollar budgeting app in it, Liz, that connects right to your bank account. And you can see where every dollar is coming in and going out. And then there's a goal tracker app, which will get you in your baby steps, paying off that debt and baby step two. But that's my gift to you. If you promise that you'll go all in on Ramsey Plus and on getting that real estate license. I absolutely will. You just confirmed for me because I've been, you know, like, okay, I looked it up and, you know, <laughs> how much does this cost? You know, there the real you estate, go. you know, so I have done some. You got it, Liz. All right. We have a deal. So now you got to follow through, Liz. 